Hey everyone, Ryan Lilly here with Old Town. I wanted to put together a brief video that dives deeper into the iPilot remote, demonstrating some of the basic operations and advanced functionality. The remote itself is waterproof, but it does not float. We strongly suggest that you use the included lanyard and clip to secure the remote to your person or your watercraft. We also added a threaded quarter 20 insert to the back of the remote, providing an additional mounting option in case you want to dock the remote on the accessory tracks using a ball mount. If you ever lose your remote, replacements can be purchased at oldtowncanoe.com. The remote takes three AAA batteries. If the batteries die in your remote, all of your personalized settings are saved. Not only can you control your autopilot kayak with the included iPilot remote, but you can use your phone. Use the iPilot smartphone app as a backup. Download the app to your phone before you go and follow the steps to pair it to your motor. Just be mindful not to hit the high speed bypass button, or as we like to call it, the bad bunny button, as this takes your kayak to the highest speed level in a matter of seconds. To turn your remote on, press and hold the check button. After reading the safety message on the screen, select the OK soft key. Your remote is locked until you hit the up or down arrow. To turn your remote off, simply hold the check button for one second. The remote will inform you that it is shutting down. Your remote already comes paired with your motor. However, if you accidentally unpair or need to pair a new remote, select the system soft key, scroll down to pair, use the check button to select. Press and hold the pair button on your motor. The remote will search for your motor via Bluetooth. Ensure that the motor is installed and plugged into your battery and the kill switch is engaged. The center button engages or disengages your motor's prop. You can increase or decrease your speed or change the direction that your motor faces. But your motor will not propel until you hit that prop button. The directional buttons turn your motor in either direction 360 degrees. The plus or minus button increases or decreases your speed. One of the most popular features and functions of the Old Town Sportsman Autopilot is SpotLock. Simply press the anchor icon to engage SpotLock. Your motor will respond quickly to keep you on your desired location. So be careful if you hit this button while going fast or while standing. Also, it should be noted that when you disengage SpotLock by pressing that SpotLock button again, the motor will return to its original direction and speed setting. If you fish a lot of the same areas in structure, you may want to save some of your favorite SpotLock coordinates. You can do this by selecting the Save soft key. This feature allows you to maintain a direction and a speed setting. Great for multitasking if you're trying to cross a large body of water. Utilize cruise control to maintain your actual speed. This will modulate the prop speed based on the current or wind conditions to ensure that you maintain a proper speed. This is great for trolling, especially if navigating a pre-saved iTrack route, which we'll cover in a minute. All you have to do is set your desired speed and then lock in cruise control by pressing the mini speedometer button to the left of spot lock. Your autopilot has the ability to retrace a path or a route with iTracks. Simply select record, then begin your route. To retrace a saved track, use go to to pull up your list of pre-saved iTracks or spot lock locations. Choose whether to navigate to the beginning or the end of your pre-saved eye track. As long as you're within one quarter mile of your saved coordinates, your kayak will take you to your desired location. For improved GPS accuracy or for additional features such as spot lock jog and advanced autopilot, you can purchase a Minn Kota Bluetooth heading sensor puck for $150. Spot lock jog allows you to move your spot lock location in five foot increments in any direction. Advanced Autopilot allows you to lock onto a specific heading and keeps you accurately on course. We hope that this video is helpful. If you'd like to read more about the iPilot remote functions or for troubleshooting, visit our website. If you have additional questions, leave them in the comments section below or reach us anytime at oldtowncanoe.com.